Hey guys, HMK once again, and I've got some very interesting news that may peek into the future of Kingdom Hearts in general for this year. Now, as we all know, Kingdom Hearts 3 didn't have a huge presence. It had like barely even a presence in E3 this year, which was a big, big, big disappointment. But we must press on. But some very interesting news came out today about Kingdom Hearts HD 2.5 Remix. Uh, Square Enix released a statement saying that Kingdom Hearts HD 2.5 Remix will be at Gamescom this year. And if you guys know what Gamescom is, it's a gaming trade uh, fair show, whatever, that takes place in Germany. Sometime uh, this month, and, well not this month, well whatever, July is over, fuck it, it's August. Sometime in August. So. HD 2.5 will be at August. Now, it's kind of weird that they said that it's going to be at the show instead of playable at the show. We can bet there's going to be demos, that's a given, because of course it's been played by every event up until now. There's going to be a demo. There might be a new trailer, you know, maybe showcasing more things of Recoded, because we got a lot of Recoded goodness. I can't believe I'm so hyped. This is like the only time I'm, only, I'm hyped for Recoded. So we might get some new things on Recoded, like a Recoded specific trailer or something at Gamescom. But they said this in the last sentence of the statement. Kingdom Hearts H 2.5 Remix will be releasing this year, December 5th, in that area, uh, for the PlayStation 3. It will act as a follow-up for last year's Kingdom Hearts 1.5 Remix and it will act and will lead into Kingdom Hearts 3. The highly anticipated Kingdom Hearts 3. They say it will lead into Kingdom Hearts 3. I find it weird that they go out of their way to like even mention Kingdom Hearts 3 at this point because of course Kingdom Hearts 3 we all know it's in development and from all the signs we know they're pointing that Kingdom Hearts 3 is not coming out anytime soon. So the fact that they say that it will lead into Kingdom Hearts 3, the fact that they mention Kingdom Hearts 3 maybe will have some sort of a little teaser again like it was a remember the teaser that was attached to Kingdom Hearts HD 2.5 Remix, the pre E3 trailer. If they were to show another trailer at Gamescom, maybe we'll have another teaser, another little nice little snippet of Kingdom Hearts 3. Maybe that would be cool. Now, among events that Kingdom Hearts 3 may be shown at, because get this, IGN ugh, did a good thing for once. They pushed the question of Kingdom Hearts 3 to Haley Joel Osment, who is the voice of Sora at San Diego Comic Con, which once again, no Kingdom Hearts 3 news, tier tier. But Tetsuya Nomura was on it. The fact that Tetsuya Nomura was there and Haley Joel Osment was there and asked them the question, have you done anything for Kingdom Hearts 3 yet? And his reaction was, uh, I can't really say anything about it, you know, the past, blah, blah, blah. He sidestepped the question. He literally sized up the question saying, I can't say anything about it, and try to segue into something else. Like, oh yeah, we like to record, blah, 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 all that good jazz, whatever. He sized up the question. And I really find it weird, I really find it dumb that, like, people, of course, I understand when you're under contract, you can't say shit. But when you say something like that, I can't say anything, that basically tells us, that confirms involvement, it, basically. I mean, you could have just said, um, yeah, it's, it's a project that is, is coming out soon, uh, you know, just sidestep all involvement, but saying that I can't really say anything, you know, about it, I understand you're under contract or whatever, but that basically involves, that basically shows involvement. So, what I'm thinking is that, along with this, Tetsuya Nomura was at the show, Haley Joe Osmo was at the show, and Shin Shinji Hashimoto, who is, I'm sorry, give me one second. Mm. Stay hydrated. But anyways, Shinji Hashimoto, who is the producer of Kingdom Hearts, uh, the whole series in Kingdom Hearts 3. Before E3, he went on to say a statement in an interview saying that, um, well, the, interview, the interviewer, I forgot the sorry, citation, whatever. He says, will we see Kingdom Hearts 3 at uh, E3? Do you have any plans for Kingdom Hearts 3 at E3? He goes on to say, it's really up in the air. That's a maybe, of course we didn't see anything, but I think you'll have a better look at Tokyo, when you're at Tokyo. So, what I'm thinking is that basically kind of confirms Kingdom Hearts 3 to be shown at a Tokyo Game Show, because of course if they're not going to show anything about Kingdom Hearts 3 this year, what the fuck? But I'm pretty sure they are, because they showed two trailers last year, the E3 trailer and the D23 uh, trailer last year, so this year they better show at least something. 
and I and even though that teaser was good, not good enough. So I'm guessing that a trailer might come out of Kinemarsu at Tokyo Game Show. And if Haley Joel Osment is going out of his way to deny, or not even deny, but just say I'm not, you know, I can't say anything, my speculation is that he already recorded something for Kingdom Hearts 3. Not for the game, but maybe he recorded his voice for a trailer where Sora will actually talk in the trailer for Kingdom Hearts 3. That directly correlates the involvement with him and Kingdom Hearts 3 that he cannot speak about. And let's face it guys, it's no secret that even the Japanese and like most of the world prefer the English voice actors to the Japanese voice actors for the Kingdom Hearts series because every time a final mix is out they're always voiced in English not Japanese the fucking remixes that are coming out now is voiced in English and Japanese but when final mix came out in Japan it was voiced in English and subbed in Japanese because they love the English voice actors they love the original voice actors from the Disney movies or whatever that's what they want so that's what I'm thinking, that Haley Joel Osment, you know, he's denying involvement. I'm pretty sure I will go out and bet 50% of my check, whatever, that he voiced something for a trailer that is going to come out at Tokyo Game Show, which has me hyped! But of course, this speculation, nothing confirmed. Don't take my word for it, guys. Just speculation, but get your minds thinking. Unleash your mind. Unleash the hype about Kingdom Hearts 3. So all this good news and all that stuff. What we learned might be a TGS, Haley Joel Osment might be uh, talking about the trailer, and Kingdom Hearts HD 2.5 Remix is going to be at Gamescom, even though they said that it's, you know, they mentioned Kingdom Hearts 3 at Gamescom. Whoa. Fucking whoa. Alright, so until the next news video, keep it at HMK, the one hectic gaming channel that seeks to hit you with hectic knowledge, theories, and hype, especially about Kingdom Hearts, Legend of Zelda, and Super Smash Bros. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe, favorite, all that good jazz. And share this channel with your friends. It'll really help me out a lot. Let's get to 20k, people. So, until the next video, until the next hype. I've been HMK. And I'll check you guys later.